hello guys welcome back again to my youtube channel my name is Nkechi or nk anyone you want to call me <laughs> i would accept it okay my channel's name is pretty nk's world and i talk about skincare beauty and lifestyle i just want to keep thanking or i'm going to keep thanking my um old and new subscribers for those of you that watch my videos and subscribe for those of you that share my video I just want to say I appreciate you big time. Okay, on today's video, I'm going to be talking about a salicylic acid moisturizer. That is the Avino Positively Radiant Clear Complexion Moisturizer. This is a moisturizer that, that is very, very good for acne-prone skin. Because most people think um, salicylic acid only comes in form of maybe a, a serum um, a cleanser or a tuna. No, it can actually come in a lotion or a cream. As a, it can come as a moisturizer too. Okay. Um, firstly, I'm going to be talk, uh, telling you guys what a, a salicylic acid is. Salicylic acid is gotten is a beta hydroxyl acid that is gotten from a um, willow tree. From a willow tree, there's a tree called willow tree. Though I've never seen it, <laughs> I've not seen it before. But there's actually a tree called willow tree. So this salicylic acid is gotten from that tree. The tree back, actually, sorry, the um, back of the tree is dried, as in dried. It must be very, very dried, and is treated with oxidants. The back of the salicylic, um, sorry, the willow tree is dried and treated with oxidant that is then turned into powder, um, turned into powder. So when after treating it with the oxidant, that is when they will turn it to acids. So that is how we get salicylic acid. And salicylic acid is very is a wrinkle fighter. It's good for dark spot. It exfoliates. It helps to. Um, minimize the secretion of sebum on the skin especially those of us that is acne prone or those of us that has a very very oily skin like mine so it helps to um to curb or minimize the over secretion of sebum on your skin so salicylic acid is if you know you have acne prone your skin is acne prone you keep battling with pimples occasional breakout of acne just use this beta hydroxyl acid, which is called the salicylic acid. Yeah. So this Avino Positively Radiant Clear Complexion Moisturizer has 0.5% of salicylic acid in it. It's a moisturizer. That is after using your cleanser, your toner, your serum or whatever. You know the last step before your SPF is the moisturizer. But but like i always tell you guys i'll prefer you to use this um salicylic acid moisturizer at night after using your facial cleanser or your body you can use it on your body too or your body cleanser whatever it should um be used that i prefer it to be used at night because even though we keep talking about or even if i keep talking about the use of spf in the morning or during the day most people don't still use SPF. So to be on a safer side, it's best you use your salicylic acid moisturizer at night when you don't need your SPF at all. Because some people, I don't know if it's laziness or they feel like it's not important to use SPF. If you are treating dark spots, you are, you are treating uh, hyperpigmentation, you are treating sunspot or dark patches and you don't use SPF, forget about it. SPF is very, very important in your skincare routine. And this Avino um, Positively Radiant Clear Complexion Moisturizer is oil-free. So if you have a, a dried skin, you can use it. Don't feel, oh, it's oil-free. There's no oil in it, so it might not be good for me. It's actually good for you. If you, if you are uh, an oily skin person, it's basically for all skin type. But it's best you introduce it like... Um, or you use it like um, maybe once a week gradually before you increase to twice a week, three times a week so that your skin will, will gradually adjust to it. Yes, it can because if you start using it for the first time or if you just introduce it into your skincare routine for the first time, it might dry out your skin because your skin is not used to it. So you will gradually build up the use 
to maybe two to uh, two times a week, three times a week. And you can also use it every day for those of you that would want to use it every day. For me personally, I like using anything that has salicylic acid three times a week. But if you know um, um, you prefer to use it every day, first start using it at least one to twice a week till your skin perfectly adjusts to it before you can start using it every day. So this moisturizer is very, very good for mild to moderate acne. If you have mild to moderate acne, moderate acne not severe acne you can use this avino positively radiant clear complexion moisturizer because it's going to help you curb your acne breakout like for me i am highly acne prone yes i break out a lot because my facial skin is very very oily but since i started using my salicylic acid um toner and um, cleanser my acne it has i don't know how to say i hardly break out Yes, even when it's that time of the month for me, you hardly see a breakout on my face. And it's very, very good for dark spots too. If you have dark spots on your skin, salicylic acid is going to, with frequent use, is going to help you to clear up the dark spots. So if you are looking for a moisturizer that can, that is like a two-in-one, that can moisturize and exfoliate your skin mildly for you, just go for the Avino Avino Positively Radiant Clear Complexion Moisturizer. Fine, there are other salicylic acid moisturizers in the market, but I'm talking because I always talk of products that I have used or I've seen somebody used and it works for them. I'm, I can't talk about um, products that I've, I've not tried myself or I've not seen any person use, or maybe I just heard it from someone. No, no, I don't do that. So this, there are other salis, good salicylic acid moisturizers in the market but this avino positively radiant clear complexion moisturizer is a very good one that is going to help you curb your acne prone skin it's going to help you to uh even out your uneven skin skin tone it's going to help you to fight wrinkles it's going to help you to mildly exfoliate your skin and at the same time it's going to moisturize and hydrate your skin so guys this is where i come to the end of today's video don't forget to keep subscribing to my youtube channel share my my videos and like my videos see ya guys bye